if it fits your macros and unrealistic expectations. I've noticed that the biggest proponents of an if it fits your macros style approach tend to be men. So the stereotypical 100 kilogram personal trainer explaining to their 60 kilogram office based female client that they can lose weight while still enjoying chocolate every day and look at their diet, they manage to fit in McDonald's and Pop-Tarts most days while maintaining a beautiful six pack. Okay, cool, but this is slightly misleading, especially when you have far less calories to play with as a small woman. You just need to hit your macros and look at all this junk food you can enjoy. Unfortunately, if you're a small woman with an office-based job, you might need as little as say 1400 calories to lose body fat. Now, you try and fit a McDonald's into those calories. If you do, you will A, be left eating salad for the rest of the day, and B, you'll miss out on good nutrients. If you have a few extra calories to play with, by all means enjoy a treat, but not at the expense of a foundation based on nutrient dense, high quality foods. The nutritional value of the foods you eat matters. It matters for health, but it also matters for fat loss and your ability to stick to a diet. You will find you are very hungry if you try to fit in junk food or higher calorie foods into your diet at the expense of nutrient dense, higher volume foods. 1400 calories can look like a lot of food and it can leave you feeling full and satisfied if you make the right food choices. Similarly, 1400 calories can look like barely any food and can leave you feeling hungry and unsatisfied if you don't make the right food choices. My point here, food choices matter. If you are on relatively low calories, focus your diet on nutrient dense foods with relatively high food volume. And by all means, if you can fit in a little treat here and there, but remember you do have less calories to play with. So you're being fooled if you believe that you can eat in the same way some of the male, if it fits your macros proponents are demonstrating on say Instagram when they upload Pop-Tarts and McDonald's. 